Hey there, nature enthusiasts. Welcome back to our channel, where we uncover the wonders of the Galapagos Islands. In today's video, we're embarking on an exciting journey to discover the most iconic species of the Galapagos Islands. Get ready to be amazed by the unique wildlife that calls this enchanting archipelago home. So, without further ado, let's dive right in. One of the most awe-inspiring species you'll encounter in the Galapagos is the iconic giant tortoise. These gentle giants have roamed the islands for thousands of years, adapting to different habitats across various islands. With their slow and steady pace, they symbolize longevity and resilience. Observing these magnificent creatures in their natural habitat is truly a humbling experience. The ancient Galapagos giant tortoises, with their colossal size and gentle demeanor, roam the lush highlands of Santa Cruz and other islands in the archipelago. These majestic giants slowly lumber from one natural banquet to another, taking their time to savor the abundant vegetation around them. While they are reasonably receptive to human interaction, they possess a defense mechanism, if startled or frightened, they will retreat into their shells, seeking solace and protection. Just like us, these remarkable tortoises have their own rituals of self-care. They enjoy taking mud baths, which not only help them cool off but also serve as a form of protection against parasites and the harsh Galapagos sun. Their diet mainly consists of tender shrubbery and vegetation, and though they may seem slow-moving, they are surprisingly gradual migrators. During the rainy season, they can travel up to 3.7 miles over six-week periods to take advantage of the green shrubs in the lowlands. The conservation efforts for these magnificent creatures are crucial, as they have faced challenges due to past human interactions and invasive species. Numerous breeding programs work tirelessly to increase and sustain the population of Galapagos giant tortoises. Thanks to these dedicated conservationists, the Galapagos giant tortoises continue to thrive, enriching the biodiversity of these extraordinary islands. It's truly a privilege to witness these ancient beings in their natural habitat, and a gentle reminder of the importance of protecting and preserving the unique wildlife of the Galapagos. Prepare to be enchanted by the dazzling blue-footed boobies, known for their vibrant blue feet and captivating courtship dances. These seabirds are excellent divers and can spot their prey from great heights before plunging into the ocean with precision. Get ready for a front row seat to witness their mesmerizing mating dance that sets the stage for romance on the islands. These clown-like birds are sure to bring a smile to your face as they carefully flap their bright blue feet in the air during their quirky courtship dance. This charming display is all part of their unique mating ritual. Nesting on the ground, the entire life cycle of these fascinating birds is on full display in the Galapagos Islands. From courtship and mating to the caring of their young ones, it's a spectacle of nature you won't want to miss. Interestingly, the vibrant blue color of their feet is a result of the carotenoids in their food supply of fish. When blue-footed booby chicks are born, they are fluffy white with black feet, a stark contrast to their parents. While their antics on the ground may make it seem like they can't fly, you'll be surprised to see some of them soaring gracefully above the islands. Their telltale blue feet make them easily distinguishable in the Galapagos skies. These magnificent birds are true aerial acrobats, adept at diving from impressive heights into the ocean to catch their favorite prey, fish. Their ability to thrive in the Galapagos is a testament to the unique ecosystems and the conservation efforts in place to protect these incredible creatures. So, if you're planning a visit to the Galapagos Islands, be sure to keep an eye out for these delightful blue-footed boobies and witness their captivating courtship dance and aerial displays. Let's dive into the vibrant world of the red-footed boobies. These quirky seabirds have their own unique way of attracting mates by using their brightly colored feet, just like their blue-footed cousins. While they might be slightly rarer than the other boobies, spotting them is like receiving an unexpected gift from the Galapagos Islands. Similar to their blue-footed cousins, these quirky seabirds also use their colored feet to attract each other during their courtship displays. But unlike the more common boobies, spotting the red-footed boobies is often like receiving an unexpected gift. One fascinating characteristic of these unique birds is that they are polymorphic, which means that each individual can have different colored plumage, ranging from brown to white. However, one feature that remains consistent among them is their bright red feet, standing out vividly against their feathers. Red-footed boobies can often be seen in pairs over several mating seasons, forming strong bonds with their mates. During their breeding season, they are devoted to caring for their young and fawn over a single large egg per season. Their singular brood ensures there's no squabbling between siblings, allowing each chick to receive ample attention and care from its parents. These agile seabirds are incredible flyers, skillfully soaring above the ocean to catch fish and squid. 
Their aerodynamic shape and powerful wings make them adept at diving into the water to secure their meals. And let's not forget their charming red feet. A vibrant splash of color amidst the blue ocean and green foliage of the Galapagos Islands. When not in flight, you can often spot red-footed boobies perched on tree branches or rocky outcrops, looking out over their island home. Their dedication to their nests and chicks is truly admirable, and observing these fascinating behaviors is a true testament to the wonders of nature. So, if you're fortunate enough to visit the Galapagos Islands, be on the lookout for these delightful red-footed boobies. Witnessing their colorful displays and nurturing behaviors is an unforgettable experience you'll cherish. What's fascinating about red-footed boobies is that they are polymorphic, which means that each individual can have different appearances with brown or white plumage. However, one thing that remains consistent is their eye-catching red feet, making them stand out amidst the diverse avian population of the islands. These endearing birds form pairs over several mating seasons and are truly devoted to each other. Each pair raises just one large egg per season, creating a harmonious environment with no squabbling between siblings or competition for food. The red-footed boobies' commitment to their partners and their unique breeding behaviors add to the already captivating allure of the Galapagos Islands. Witnessing these delightful seabirds in action is an unforgettable experience that reminds us of the wonders of nature. If you're lucky enough to spot the red-footed boobies during your Galapagos adventure, consider it a rare and special encounter with one of the archipelago's most charming inhabitants. Let's shift our attention to the magnificent Nazca boobies. These impressive seabirds are much larger than their booby cousins, standing tall at up to 35 inches in height. One can easily recognize them by their distinctive markings a long orange beak, a black ring around their eyes and beak, and a slender snow-white body with black underwings and tails. Interestingly, their natural selection has led them to have gray feet, indicating a less specific diet compared to their more colorful counterparts. While Nazca boobies may not have the same rigid mating rituals observed in other booby species, their dedication to their offspring is unwavering. Parental care is a top priority for them, and they tirelessly work to keep their young safe and well-nurtured. One fascinating adaptation they possess is the ability to use their heavily vascularized feet to transmit heat to their eggs, ensuring they remain warm during the incubation period. As we explore the diverse avian life of the Galapagos, the Nazca boobies stand out as a symbol of resilience and adaptability. Their distinct appearance and nurturing behaviors add a touch of wonder to the already enchanting island ecosystem. From their remarkable size to their unique features, encountering these majestic seabirds during your Galapagos journey is an awe-inspiring experience that leaves a lasting impression. Get ready to be amazed by another unique species found in the Galapagos Islands, the frigate bird. These majestic birds are a captivating sight to behold. Frigate birds can be spotted flying overhead on most of the islands in the Galapagos. While their coloring may seem rather plain, the males and females have some distinctive features that set them apart. The adult male frigate birds showcase a stunning bright red dueler sac, which is a large inflatable throat pouch used to attract females during their breeding season. During this time, you might spot the male frigate birds perched on low shrubbery, with their beaks pointing towards the sky, making guttural percussive sounds aimed at the females soaring above. It's a remarkable spectacle as the males compete to impress the females, and apparently, the bigger and redder the gular sac, the more attractive they are to potential mates. If a female is impressed by a particular male's display, she'll fly down to initiate the romance. The frigate bird's unique courtship behaviors and striking appearance make them one of the most fascinating bird species in the Galapagos. So, if you ever find yourself exploring the Galapagos Islands, don't forget to keep an eye on the skies for these graceful frigate birds. Yes, you heard it right. Penguins in the Galapagos. Despite being close to the equator, the Galapagos Islands are home to the charming Galapagos penguins, the only penguin species to inhabit this part of the world. These agile birds have adapted to the warm climate and thrive in the cool waters of the Humboldt Current. It's a delight to watch them zoom through the water with grace. Surprising, isn't it? These penguins, typically associated with cold climates, have made the Galapagos Islands their home, showcasing the extraordinary adaptability of nature. Initially attracted to the cooler Humboldt and Cromwell currents and the abundance of smaller fish, the Galapagos penguins have remarkably adapted to life in this tropical paradise. With their distinctive black and white bands, these tiny penguins stand at an average height of just 19 inches, making them the second smallest species of penguins in the world. Galapagos penguins are often seen in their mated pairs, a testimony to their strong bond and monogamous nature. They engage in various behaviors, from shading themselves to diving for fish. 
In the scorching Galapagos heat, you might spot these clever penguins hunching forward to keep the sun off their feet, which serves as their biggest heat exchange surface. When temperatures soar, they resort to panting as a cooling mechanism, showcasing their resourcefulness in adapting to their environment. During the nesting season, these penguins skillfully hide their eggs in the deep crevices of volcanic rocks, providing protection and a safe environment for their offspring. Galapagos penguins are fantastic swimmers, using their flipper-like wings to propel themselves effortlessly through the crystal-clear waters of the islands. Beneath the surface, they display their remarkable agility as they dive to catch small fish and other marine creatures, which form a crucial part of their diet. Like all creatures of the Galapagos, the Galapagos penguins play a vital role in maintaining the ecological balance of this unique ecosystem. Observing these charming penguins in their natural habitat is a true delight, and visitors to the Galapagos are fortunate to witness such an exceptional sight. Meet the majestic waved albatross, an extraordinary seabird that undertakes incredible long-distance migrations. Their unique courtship dance is a sight to behold, involving intricate movements and synchronized calls. The breeding ground of the waved albatross is Española Island, making it a vital site for conservation efforts. The Galapagos albatross, also known as the waved albatross, is the only albatross species found in the tropics, making it a rare and extraordinary sight in these equatorial waters. One of the distinctive features of the Galapagos albatross is the markings on its wings, which resemble waves, earning it the nickname, waved albatross. With its bright yellow bill, yellowish cream-colored neck and head, and brownish body, it's easily recognizable among the island's diverse avian population. Another interesting characteristic is the light blue feet of the Galapagos albatross, adding a unique touch of color to its appearance. Now, here's a fascinating fact, the Galapagos albatross has an intriguing defense mechanism. It produces a special stomach oil, which acts as a deterrent against predators, giving them an edge in the harsh island environment. Albatrosses feed on energy-rich food sources, which are essential for nourishing their chicks and preparing for their long, remarkable flights across the open ocean. During the breeding season, visitors to Española Island may witness the heartwarming sight of the Galapagos albatross caring for their adorable chicks, providing a tender glimpse into their nurturing and devoted parenting. These majestic birds are highly skilled flyers, capable of soaring gracefully through the skies for extended periods, traveling vast distances over the open ocean. It's time to meet the playful and social Galapagos sea lions. These marine mammals are incredibly friendly, and you might find them lounging on the beaches or playfully interacting with snorkelers and divers. Their charming personalities make them beloved residents of the Galapagos. Galapagos sea lions are like the spirited teenagers of the islands, and you can often find them lolling about on the sandy beaches and rocky outcrops. Their curious nature often leads them to join snorkelers in the water, as if they're trying to encourage a game of fetch or simply enjoy a swim together. However, a word of caution, these adorable sea lion pups may be playful, but their mothers are always vigilant and protective. It's essential to respect their space and observe from a safe distance. Galapagos sea lions are the smallest species of sea lions, and they have several distinctive features that set them apart from their fur seal counterparts. Look closely, and you'll notice their flatter ear flaps, smoother skin, and pointier noses, all of which contribute to their unique appearance. These playful sea lions are superb swimmers, thanks to their streamlined bodies and powerful flippers, which allow them to gracefully glide through the water. When they're not swimming or frolicking in the waves, you can often find them sunbathing on the sandy shores, taking in the warm Galapagos sun. Galapagos sea lions are highly social animals, and their colonies are bustling with activity. From boisterous barks to playful nudges, their interactions are a joy to witness. Watching young sea lion pups learn to swim and play in the water is an enchanting sight. It's a testament to the natural wonders that thrive in the Galapagos. Whether you're snorkeling, diving, or simply observing from the shore, interacting with these marine marvels is an experience you'll cherish forever. Now, let's turn our attention to the adorable Galapagos fur seals. These charming creatures are quite different from their more well-known cousins, the Galapagos sea lions. You'll primarily find Galapagos fur seals frequenting the islands of Isabella and Fernandina. Their small, bear-like faces peering out from their thick brown coats make them easily distinguishable in the more sheltered areas around these islands. Interestingly, Galapagos fur seals hold the title of being the world's smallest pinniped, which refers to seals, sea lions, and walruses. Despite their diminutive size, they live in colonies and showcase fascinating social behaviors during the mating season. During this time, the male fur seals establish and guard their territories, exhibiting their assertiveness to attract potential mates. 
However, what sets Galapagos fur seals apart from other fur seal species is the extended period that mothers and pups stay together. This prolonged bond allows visitors a wonderful opportunity to witness heartwarming scenes of mothers caring for their playful pups. Observing their nurturing behaviors is a truly heartening experience, showcasing the strong maternal instincts of these adorable creatures. As we immerse ourselves in the wonders of the Galapagos Islands, encountering the playful antics of the Galapagos fur seals is a delight that captures the essence of the unique wildlife found in this pristine archipelago. The Galapagos Islands have their own unique species of cormorants, the flightless cormorants. As their name suggests, they have lost their ability to fly over time, but that hasn't stopped them from becoming excellent divers. Watching them swim and hunt underwater is a testament to the wonders of natural selection. Living in a habitat with relatively few predators, the flightless cormorant has evolved to be quite sedentary, often remaining within a limited area of just 660 square feet throughout its entire life. Despite its flightless status, this cormorant is a skilled swimmer, using its webbed feet to propel itself gracefully through the water in pursuit of its favorite food, which includes fish, squid, and octopus. The mating ritual of the flightless cormorant is a captivating sight to behold. It begins with a synchronized dance in the water, as the male and female swim around each other before moving onto the land. The male tries to win the female's affection by presenting her with gifts of seaweed and other flotsam he finds along the shore. Once their bond is established, the pair works together to care for their eggs, ensuring their safe incubation until hatching. However, their relationship might not always be lifelong. If food is abundant and the chicks are nearly 70 days old, the female may choose to seek another mate to start another brood. The flightless cormorant's fascinating behaviors and adaptations are a testament to the wonders of evolution and the incredible diversity found in the Galapagos Islands. Now, let's talk about a species that is both bizarre and fascinating, the Galapagos marine iguanas. Unlike their more recognizable terrestrial counterparts, the Galapagos marine iguana is a true wonder of nature. These black-crested dinosaurian creatures can often be spotted sunbathing on the volcanic rocks, basking in the sun to raise their body temperature. But their talents don't stop there. These marine iguanas are also skilled swimmers, elegantly gliding through the water in search of their primary food source, algae. They can dive and forage underwater for up to an impressive 30 to 40 minutes. One quirky behavior you may observe is their sneezing and snorting. Due to the high salt content of their food, their bodies cannot tolerate it. So, they've developed a unique way to rid themselves of excess salt. You may have noticed that some of these iguanas have a white coating over their heads. It may seem unusual, but it's actually a collection of the salt that has been sneezed out, creating a peculiar yet fascinating sight. Another intriguing phenomenon you might encounter is the presence of banded or light-colored speckled iguanas. This is the result of a male marine iguana mating with a female land iguana, creating a hybrid iguana with unique markings. While the marine iguanas are remarkable, let's not forget about their land-dwelling cousins, the Galapagos land iguanas. These ancient reptiles showcase vivid colors and are an essential part of the island's ecosystem. Catching a glimpse of them amidst the volcanic landscape is like stepping back in time. These creatures may seem otherworldly with their mottled, leathery yellow skin, crested back, and thick claws. But don't let their appearance fool you, they're some of the most intriguing and majestic inhabitants of the islands. When it comes to protecting their territory, Galapagos land iguanas are fierce competitors. With a bold bob of their head, they assert their dominance and, when necessary, may even engage in heated battles with their fellow iguanas. Survival in the Galapagos can be challenging, especially during the scorching summer months. These iguanas have adapted to their environment with their tough skin and thick claws, which come in handy when foraging for food or seeking hydration from the juicy prickly pear cacti. When they're not on the hunt for food, Galapagos land iguanas seek shelter from the blazing sun by retreating into burrows or taking refuge in the crevices between the volcanic rocks. One remarkable aspect of these creatures is their curiosity towards visitors. While they may appear stoic, they seem genuinely intrigued by the presence of humans on their island home. Galapagos land iguanas truly lord over the islands, embodying the spirit of these unique and isolated ecosystems. Now, let's turn our attention to a unique and remarkable resident of the Galapagos, the Santa Fe land iguana. This extraordinary species is an endemic treasure, meaning it can only be found on Santa Fe Island. The Santa Fe land iguana is instantly recognizable by its distinctive features. Sporting smaller dorsal fins, it boasts a slightly paler yellowish-brown coloring that allows it to seamlessly blend in with its surroundings. When you venture to Santa Fe Island, 
you'll have the opportunity to witness something truly fascinating, the intriguing symbiotic relationship between these magnificent iguanas and Darwin's finches. These iconic finches descend upon the iguanas, not to cause any harm, but to feed off the parasites found on their backs. It's an incredible display of nature's interconnectedness, where one species benefits from the presence of another. As you observe this harmonious interaction, you'll gain a deeper appreciation for the delicate balance of life on the Galapagos Islands and the fascinating ways in which these creatures have adapted to their unique environment. The Santa Fe Land Iguana's remarkable adaptability and its exclusive presence on Santa Fe Island make it a true symbol of the Galapagos' extraordinary biodiversity. So, if you're lucky enough to encounter these mesmerizing iguanas during your visit to Santa Fe Island, take a moment to marvel at their beauty and the delicate web of life that sustains them. Now, let's meet one of the most intriguing and impressive predators of the Galapagos, the Galapagos hawk. This remarkable bird is a true symbol of the archipelago's unique and diverse wildlife. The Galapagos hawk is an endemic species, meaning it can only be found here in the Galapagos Islands. It's easily distinguishable by its heavy build and its coloring, which can vary from sooty brown to black and white. Interestingly, the size of the Galapagos hawk can also vary significantly depending on the specific area of the archipelago where it's found. This adaptability to different environments is a testament to the hawk's remarkable resilience. As a top predator of the Galapagos, the Galapagos hawk is a powerful and agile hunter. Its diet consists of a variety of prey, including iguana or turtle hatchlings, insects, and carcasses. When it comes to mealtime, the Galapagos hawk has a unique social structure. The dominant hawk always eats first, while its lieutenants stand guard, ensuring a successful and efficient feeding session. Observing the Galapagos hawk in action is a fascinating experience that reminds us of the delicate balance of predator and prey in the Galapagos ecosystem. These magnificent birds are a testament to the Galapagos conservation efforts and the importance of preserving their natural habitat for generations to come. If you want to witness the Galapagos hawk in all its glory, make sure to join one of our future expeditions to the Galapagos Islands. Let's delve into the world of the vibrant American flamingo. With its stunningly bright pink plumage, the American flamingo is a remarkable sight against the backdrop of the muddy marshlands where they gracefully forage for algae and small invertebrates. This seemingly enormous bird presents a fascinating blend of contradictions. Their elegant marching may appear graceful, yet it's accompanied by a somewhat comical, goose-like honking sound. But the true spectacle lies in their captivating mating rituals. Picture this. Their courtship dances resemble scenes from grand ballrooms of centuries past. When a male flamingo struts by, if a receptive female catches his attention, she elegantly follows his lead in a mesmerizing dance of affection. These enchanting rituals have a purpose, they strengthen the bond between potential mates and are an essential part of the flamingo's unique courtship process. Watching these elaborate performances is like witnessing nature's own ballet, brimming with grace and charm. As dedicated parents, American flamingos carefully tend to their nests and nurture their young, ensuring the next generation thrives in this vibrant ecosystem. So, the next time you spot the striking silhouette of an American flamingo in the Galapagos, take a moment to appreciate the elegance of their movements and the timeless beauty of their age-old courtship rituals. And there you have it, fellow explorers. The Galapagos Islands are a treasure trove of unique and iconic species. Each encounter with these remarkable creatures leaves an indelible impression, reminding us of the importance of preserving these delicate ecosystems. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more exciting nature insights. Let us know in the comments which Galapagos species you find the most fascinating. Until next time, happy exploring!